become 2,400. That's the number, the main number. Because the 8 is greater than 5, so the 8 will add up to the 3, and the 3 will One. turn into 4. Very good. So that makes, or that gives you? 2,400,000. Very good. That's the, end. That's the answer. Tama. Now this time, why, uh, why is it 1,300,000? This is the number. Yes. How did you arrive with 1,300,000 rounding off to the, the nearest 100,000? How did you arrive with the answer? How did, how did we arrive with this answer? Because the 4 is less than 5. So, mm -hmm. so the 3 and the 1 will stay put and the rest of the numbers become 0. Okay, stay put. Okay, I see. It's very good. Okay, how about here? What? Oh, okay, why do we... How did we? How did we get the seven million six hundred thousand answer? Because in the uh, number place, it's um the six is greater than five, so the six will add up to the five, and the seven will stay, and the rest of the numbers become zero, and the five turns into. Six. Perfect. Okay, very good. You explained it very well. Okay, you explained it very well, Mary Grace. Perfect. Okay. So I think you know you you I mean uh, you understand this already. Uh, the rounding numbers to the nearest hundred thousand and million. So let's check your understanding after this discussion here. Okay. Now let's try to round each number to the place value of underlying digit okay so we follow the underlying digit here mary grace look at this okay this one is actually millions and then hundred thousands and then millions hundred thousands and then millions okay okay can you try it number one what's your answer um Thousand. Double check it, Mary Grace. Remember that we are rounding off hundred thousands and millions. Million, twelve million. Is that your final answer? Yeah. Okay. Okay, actually that's right. Very good. How about number two? Um, three thousand uh, three million five hundred uh, three million five hundred. Three million five hundred? Are you sure with that? Again, what's your final answer? Three million 500,000. Okay, very good. Because if you say 3,500,000, that's the same. That's the same. Okay? 3,500,000. That's it. That. So your answer is 3,500,000. Right? Okay, okay, very good. Number three. Five million. Why? Because the number that's next to five is actually zero, so it's less than five. So Very good. How about number four? Nine million eight hundred thousand. Nine million eight hundred thousand. Very good. How about number five? Six million. Six million. Is that your final answer? Yeah. 
Okay, very good. Mary Grace, good job. You did well on this activity here. Your answers are all correct. Okay? Okay. All right. I think uh, the, uh, madali mo lang maintindihan na catch up yung lesson. I remember when I asked you if you remember the rounding off in your previous grade level, you said you think you forgot it. So, since we're running out of time, Mary Grace, I will give this as your homework, okay? Okay. Okay, I will send this to you later after this class, and then you're going to do this as your homework, okay? And oh, I still have to give you more homework, this one. Okay, para bukas, we will have a test. Okay. You can submit this homework to, to me anytime today that I'm going to check it before your test tomorrow, okay? So okay. that will be the test day for your practice, for this practice, and then you're going to answer like 20 items, and then uh, you're going to get at least 16 out of 20. And the topics are, yeah, the number this, yung, yung visualizing large numbers, the writing numbers in symbols and in words, and this rounding off, okay? Okay. Thank you so much. Um, Mary Grace, I'm very happy to see you working like that. So please continue, okay?